The Bauts, an Indo-European people group, inhabited a vast territory stretching from the Baltic Sea to the Volga during the migration period, interacting with Uralic people in the east and Slavic people in the south and west. Their cultural development was significantly influenced by the Trinyats culture, a prominent archaeological complex that flourished between the 13th and 8th centuries before the Common Era. The Eastern Balts contributed greatly to the genesis of Russians, Poles and Belarusians, although the majority of their ancestry is still Slavic and not Baltic. Some examples of Baltic toponyms from, for example, the Tver region of Russia include Meja River from Baltic Miars meaning forest or Tsna River from Baltic Tusna meaning quiet. For this video I gathered 14 Baltic DNA samples, 5 of which were from the migration period and 9 from the Viking Age. I ran the samples from my trait predictor tool for DNA analysis and here are their results. The most common predicted phenotypes were Hallstatt, Norded and North Ponted. Alpinid phenotype was also pretty common, and one sample scored an outlier Indo-Nordic phenotype as its predicted phenotype. Here is the average predicted phenotype morph of these Baltic samples. The most common eye colors among the Baltic samples were blue and hazel, and no sample scored dark brown eyes as its predicted eye color. A couple of samples scored green and blue eyes with an amber center. The most common hair color by far was dark blonde, with light brown and dark brown hair being less common. No samples scored red or black or light blonde hair. The most common predicted skin color was white, and 4 samples scored olive skin tone, and 2 samples scored palest skin tone. No samples scored brown skin tones. The most common predicted hair textures were straight and wavy, but one person also scored kinky hair. The most common predicted nose shape was Greek, with 9 samples scoring this as their predicted nose shape, and 5 samples were predicted to have snub nose shapes. 5 of the samples were predicted to be taller than average, and 9 samples were predicted to be shorter. Regarding the Warrior vs. Warrior trait, the Balts had a strong predisposition to Warrior phenotype with higher dopamine levels and lower tolerance to stress. The Balts were predisposed to an average availability of D2 receptors, which leads to average odds of schizophrenia and thought disorders, as well as no-go learning. The Balts had average odds of bipolar 1, low odds of depression, and low odds of ADHD. The Balts had roughly average predisposition to autism, and 1 out of 14 was predicted to be lactase persistent. The Balts had a predisposition to an average level of empathy based on OXTR genotypes. The Balts had a strong predisposition to lower odds of cardiovascular issues and lower homocysteine levels, which are very good predispositions that lead to lower odds of heart attack, stroke, aneurysm, and other cardiovascular events. They had average levels of LDL cholesterol as well. The Balts had lower odds of epithelial cancers based on 8Q24 genotypes and average odds of leukemia. The Balts also had low odds of migraine. The Balts had very strong predisposition to hemoglobin E disease, with 8 out of 14 samples carrying risk variants for this condition. The Balts had an average predisposition to myopia and an average predisposition to Alzheimer's disease. The Balts had average odds of autoimmune disease based on HLA genotypes, however had very high prevalence of multiple sclerosis and hla drb one risk variants. Despite the fact that 6 out of 14 Baltic samples scored very high odds for multiple sclerosis and carried drb one risk variants for MS, Every sample scored average odds for autoimmune type 1 diabetes. The Balts had average odds for metabolic type 2 diabetes. The Balts as a whole had lower glucose levels, which is good, and all of them also scored intermediate for odds of obesity. None of the Balts were predicted to have hemochromatosis based on their predicted iron levels. Most of the Balts were predicted to have low red blood cell count. 
Regarding muscle type and ACT and 3 genotype, the bots were certainly very unathletic. The sprinter allele was very underrepresented among them compared to the European average. The bots had average odds of alcoholism. The bots had lower odds of syncope, which is sudden loss of consciousness due to loss of blood flow to the brain. The bots had every blood type, including blood types A, B, O, and AB, but the most common blood groups among them were A and O. Thank you for watching my video until the end, I hope you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and share if you did. Links to purchase trade predictor as well as raw DNA files of the bots analyzed in this video will be in the description. Thanks for watching, goodbye.